Tomorrow should be the greatest day of Erica Stroud Jones's life. The brilliant young British scientist has made an incredible breakthrough against the deadly tropical disease of malaria. She's here in Amsterdam to present it. There will be skeptics and rivals, friends and admirers, but most of all the man she wants to impress, Max Carver, her new love. But during the night, Erica disappears. Max is desperate and frightened and he searches everywhere for her. Then he descends into an underworld of malice and cunning. But most of all, when he finds her diary, he cannot believe the darkness at the heart of the woman he loves. This is a story set on two levels. You have the narrative about Max seeking his girlfriend back, but underneath it you have the story of malaria, the most deadly disease in the world today which kills more people every day than died in September the 11th. There are thousands of underfunded scientists who still fight against malaria and although there is now a partial vaccine the fight goes on. This book, although it's fiction, shines a light onto the struggles every day of many of those brave scientists who are trying to do good and yet they almost never get any publicity for it. So I leave you with one question. What would happen if a new, deadlier version of malaria were released across the developed world, starting in Amsterdam?